WTFNN. Headline news update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 2 p.m. Eastern time on Tuesday, two hours left to go in the trading day. And we got markets in positive territory, but pretty dramatically off the highs. S&P's up six points, trading at 2846. Dow Jones up 48 points, trading at 25,963. And the NASDAQ up about 33 points, trading at 7747. Dollar index, negative 158 ticks, trading at 95,825. Oil, negative 25 cents, trading at 58,84. We get the API number, 4.30 Eastern time tonight. And gold up almost $6 at 13.0730. We'll start things off with the futures charts. We'll start it off with the Dow. So the story coming out at about 12.45, an hour and 15 minutes ago, that China may be pulling back a bit from some of the promises they had made as they're negotiating trade talks. With that, putting a little bit of a spook into the market, we trade from a high at noon of 26,143. You got the futures now under 26,000, 25,998. S&P is much the same. Highs made right at noon. 28.58, currently trading 28.47 in that S&P. NASDAQ 100, trading at 73.99. Highs of the session, 74.20, so about 20 NASDAQ 100 points. Jumping over to crude oil, a little bit of volatility in both directions. Crude, high for the session, 59.83, 7 a.m. this morning. You got crude dip below $59 briefly, currently trading at 59.22. Gold contract volatility as well in both directions. Made it up there at almost 13.11. We'll call it 13.1072. Gold trading at 13.0729. And Euro US dollar currently trading at 1.1354. In terms of what else you have happening across the market, checking in at some of the movers and shakers. Tesla out there basically flat for the day. Had spiked to 263.46 earlier this morning. Apple announcing some revamps to some of their products as well, off about a half a percent. Jumping over to some of the FANG stocks. Facebook getting a pop up 1.55%. GE had some action up two-tenths of a percent. And the chip stocks really rocking. NVIDIA up 4.2%. Micron up 2.1%. Broadcom up 2.2%. Quite a number. Stay tuned, folks. We got a man Dave White coming up right now at the Power Trading Hour live from 2 till 3. Tom O'Brien live from 3 till 5. Stay tuned. Have a great Tuesday.